you're not even using much fabric to achieve this. So first um, line I want to take note is the elastic casing, which is 1.5. I'll indicate the hip line at 9 inches. Then the next is going to be the crotch that I use the hip circumference divided by 4. In this case, it's 44 divided by 4, 11. I'll add 2 inches extra, making it 13. Lowest part, I'm going inwards by 1 inches. On the upper part there, I'll go inwards by 0 0.5 inches. So these two points, I'll connect them well to the hip line. So right now, I'm going to fix in what my hip circumference divided by 4. Remember, I said 44 divided by 4, that's 11. Okay, I mark it out on the crotch line there. Then I'll add 3 inches. On that crotch line, I'm putting in 2.5 inches for my crotch. And I'll go ahead now and take it straight down. So the crotch for both the front and the back. So you can see how this looks now. I'll join the sides. I'll hem the lowest part first. I'm just going to what we're passing my last. See you on the next one. Bye.